<coughs> Good morning, everybody. I'm um, sorry that took a little bit longer. I needed to have a coffee and I didn't boil the jog. And our jog takes forever to boil. So, <coughs> we are back to the normal schedule. Sorry if I'm out of shot. I'm just trying to get myself in a comfy spot. <coughs> We're back to the regular schedule. Sorry for about the last couple of days. Um, obviously attending the uh, Australian Games Awards, which was amazing. Let's check my mic and stuff. Everything's good. Um, yeah, so thank you again. A huge thank you to everybody that took time out of their day to nominate me and also... Um, I'm good, Nicholas. Um, so yeah, thank you so much to everybody that, um, nominated and also voted for me, um, to, in my category. Uh, I, I didn't win, but you know, it, there's always a silver lining. It was, uh, an amazing experience to go to. Um, and yeah, it's obviously, um, yeah, I, it was just so, so good. Um, yeah, so good. Hey guys, how are you both? But I'm very good. Um, I'm just a little tired today still. Um, our flight, there was huge storms. We had to go to Sydney. So it's about an hour and a bit flight for us from our house. Obviously from the city we live in. Um, and so, yeah, when we went, uh, when we were coming home, there was a massive storm in Sydney. And we ended up being delayed, I think, about five or six hours in the airport. Um, which was okay because obviously I'd rather be safe than fly in a storm. Um, see, we didn't get home till really late last night and I still haven't eaten anything. I haven't eaten anything, I think, since yesterday morning. Um, I'm not hungry though, so I'm just going to keep drinking, drinking coffee. I know. Uh, thank you, O'Billy. Like, it's okay I didn't win. Um, like, of course, I really, you know, I really wanted to win because, um, it was so humbling to have the community obviously, you know, put me there in the first place and think that um, my content was good enough. Um, but yeah, just having the experience, um, you know, heck, Steph, um, Stephanie's one of my idols and to have her on stage also announce my name was just like a surreal moment. Um, so yeah, it was um, like, I got, if people ask me what the experience is like, I, I just, I really can't explain it. It was, um, it was like nothing else. So yeah. Um, uh, ha, ha. um so we did visit PlayStation AU. Um, obviously normally I vlog and record everything. Um, but again, it was just such a whirlwind of a couple of days. Um, I did take some footage, uh, before the AGAs and I'll probably try and, um, do like a recap video more so as well as a bit of a vlog, um, about it, uh, because a lot happened and in the venue, um, it was really dark, like obviously, um, yeah, it's, it's a bit hard to explain, but if you were watching it, um, on Twitch, they did stream it on Twitch. It was a little dark. Um, so yeah, I, I didn't record too much there and I didn't record anything in PlayStation. Um, like we could have taken photos and stuff like that, but I, I didn't do that. So, um, it was just really nice to be, uh, to go, um, have the opportunity to go there. Um, we did play a game that I can talk about. Um, it was nothing that we didn't, um, that we didn't like there was nothing that we t we were we played that I can't talk about. So yeah, we um we played Beat Saber for ages and had a little competition. It was so much fun. So um, I'm going to be buying Beat Saber uh, and we're going to be playing it over Christmas and doing a lot of live streams for um, PlayStation VR games. Uh, this like over the Christmas break, we're having heaps of people over. Uh, so we're going to have like maybe even like a running competition or something. Uh, but we'll live stream all of that stuff as well. So. That's going to be really, really fun. So yeah, I've got to buy Beat Saber. It was good. Um, Armando, I do realize that sometimes you comment on uh, my Instagram. I did reply to this question, questions, should I say, uh, on one of my earlier YouTube videos. I did reply. Um, do I like country music? I don't mind it. I don't listen to it all the time. I like Garth Brooks. Um, and uh, there's a couple of other artists, but I particularly do like Garth Brooks. Um do I want kids as I replied it is too much of a personal question and I won't answer that to anybody um, on my channel uh, so I'm sorry I won't answer that question and um, 
I only speak English and I only understand English. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, but sometimes if um, followers do end up um, or subscribers uh, writing something in um, their language, I've had Russian, Spanish, um, Korean, uh, Japanese. I sort of understand a little bit, um, but I'm like basic, so basic. Um, and uh, like I've had heaps of languages um, popped on my channel and I do translate them because I try to get back to every single comment uh, no matter what. So if you have another language um, that you would like to ever you, you want to comment on my videos, um, I do my best to do a translation um, on Google and I translate what I'm going to say back to you. So, But anyway, let's get into a game of Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy. We are playing the first Crash Bandicoot. Um, the first... Um, oh, this freaking stage. I got stuck on here the other day. So... Um, when uh, I, I played this the other day, uh, we have obviously part one of this live stream. I don't know if I'll be able to finish the game today, um, but we'll try. And I'm sorry if my voice is a little bit crackly. Um, when I don't get as much sleep, I seem to definitely have a crackly voice. But how good is Crash Bandicoot? It's one of my absolute favourites. Absolute favourites. Um, I've been a huge Crash fan since I was a kid, obviously. And I haven't, um, I haven't played through these. I got really frustrated on a <laughs> on a later stage uh, when I was playing it um, on the PS4 Pro and on my 4K TV. And this game looks amazing. On the big TV but that's one thing I'm gonna be working on uh, this year um, oh shit I always forget about the um, those bats um, that's one thing I'll be working on this year is uh, a better monitor for my streaming setup um, I do love the fact that when I get to stream in the middle of the day I have natural light coming in front of me so hopefully I'm nice and bright for you guys uh, on the streams but I really would like a bit better of TV, maybe a TV, a monitor, monitor or TV. Um, I'm sitting close to it though, so maybe, maybe not too big. Oh shit, I forgot again, you gotta walk onto it and then it This stage, it always challenges me. You'll get it, don't rage quit. I know, I was pretty close the other day too. Oh no, I wasn't gonna rage quit. I kept my calm pretty, pretty good. Um, hey, MNX. Oh, did it? Oh, I need to watch it. I love the guys at Pixel Game Squad. You guys will already know um, I am an absolutely huge fan. Um, I talk to um, Mikey and Aaron occasionally. Um, yeah, they are amazing. Amazing channel um, and huge inspiration. I love the way that they shoot their videos um, as episodes as well. Uh, and they're always so informative. So... Um, if you haven't uh, followed, uh, subscribed to the Pixel Game Squad, please go check them out. They might pop in. Sometimes they pop into to my streams as well. So if they've just loaded a video up, they, um, they'll be watching their comments. Uh, they're also great guys. They get back to almost every single one of their comments as well. Um, super down to earth. Um, yeah, and I'm very honoured that... I can call them friends, so. Looking forward to one time when we can try and get over to America again. Hey, Abby. Um, yeah, it's such a great game. It sure is. I'm trying to get through it today, so. Um, funny with soft skin. Hey, Gary, how are you? How was the Game Awards experience? It was amazing. Um, it's, yeah, like... Uh, I'm still trying to find the right words, um, you know, uh, just regarding it. Uh, the experience was like nothing um, I've had, like, had the opportunity to do before. Oh, I did it again. I did the same mistake the other day. Um, yeah, I haven't 
haven't experienced anything quite like that before. Um, and yeah, just like it would have been amazing to have won. It would have been like the cherry on top. Um, but yeah, just to be in the same room with a lot of people that I admire as well. Um, was, yeah, just you can't. Yeah, it's yes, yeah, it was amazing. <laughs> But there's always next year. There is always next year. Um, and I don't intend on stopping my content or anything like that. Um, if anything, you know, walking away, I feel even more inspired um, to create and push myself to do a lot more. So. Okay, cool. Um, you deserve to win, and I was glad that you didn't. I know. Thank you very much. Um, the support for the channel um, and the videos that I create, uh, I know I'm only a little channel, but um, I'm really, like, I get a bit teary about it, like, just reading such lovely comments um, from yourself and everyone, um, people that have reached out on Instagram as well. Um, you know, even, like, friends uh, that went to the event um, came up to me and introduced themselves like I only know them through Instagram but meeting them in person was amazing uh, on Wednesday night having other industry people come up and say you know that the work they've looked at some of the body of my work so far and think you know it's really good um, it's just so humbling and yeah I just so inspired to just keep going and um, pushing ah, pushing myself to to create more stuff so yeah What do you think about? I don't know. I don't know what that is. I don't have a look it up. I have to Google it. Um, I started this game, but it was. St oh no! I have. Oh, who's like someone broke into your house or something? That's terrible. Um, I I did get an invite. Um, I was nominated. Um, in my category for breakout creator. Oh shit! I've got to time that a bit better. Um, and, uh, then, yeah, I, obviously, um, people voted to nominate, um, then from the nominations, um, they, people voted to, um, become a finalist, and I ended up becoming a finalist, so, yeah, it was amazing. Um, my husband, uh, was nominated in his category, uh, for Social Media God, um, you know, unfortunately, he didn't um, become a finalist, but it was still really good for you know to, for him to also be acknowledged in uh, for his Instagram and uh, you know being part of the community, not just here in Australia but worldwide. Like, yeah, so that was really amazing as well. Yeah, definitely. Everyone does start with with uh, with zero count. So yeah, that's very true, Gary. Oh, I should have just been more patient. Yeah, thank you very much, um, Abby, for that as well. Like, it was it was just such a great experience. Um, yeah, everyone was really lovely as well. I think that's something that should be really taken out of the, that experience as well. Like, um, there are some people that were there that, you know, have quite um, huge, huge reach. Um, everyone was really humble and nice and, uh, yeah, lovely to talk to. And I was able to meet one of my, um, uh, just a huge inspiration, uh, Ray Johnston. So, yeah, she is, um, <laughs> amazing and, um, 
yeah, being able to meet her, uh, yeah, just, I, I've been trying not to cry about it for two days, so yeah, 2019, oh, 2019 is going to be a huge one, guys, so, yeah, thank you, and s stick with me, hopefully we've got a lot more bigger things uh, coming. Was Joel there? No, Joel wasn't there. It was held in Sydney, um, which is a couple of hours flight from Victoria. Um, he was nominated um, in the YouTube uh, creator category. Um, oh, I slipped off just a little bit. Uh, I'll read that in a second, Gary. Um, I'm just going to try and concentrate on getting past this area. Um, but yeah, Joel... Uh, Joel was nominated. Um, I don't believe he became a finalist though in the YouTube category, which is obviously unfortunate because his um, content is amazing. Um, so yeah, hopefully, hopefully next year, um, you know, obviously different. Like you know, I'm so different as well. Like than some of the other YouTube uh, content creators and streamers. So yeah, hopefully next year, um, you know, Joel can uh, get nominated and become a finalist and stuff like that. So, but yeah, I'd really love to catch up with Joel again at some point. I'm not gonna let those bats get me this time. So yeah, I'd love to meet Joel again. Um, that would be <laughs> like so good. So hopefully that'll happen. Sorry, I just have to answer a question. All right. Um, random question, but his neighbor's show on TV. Yeah. Um, it, is, it is still on uh, here in Australia. Um, it used to be on sort of like a more primetime channel, but now it's gone to a diff... I think it's still on. Um, sorry, everyone. Um, yeah, so, uh, Neighbours was really big here in Australia too for an, a while. Um, but I feel like it's sort of like not as big as it used to be. Um, I had a, a series of time where I just used to watch it ri like ridiculously. Um, but I don't anymore. Um, <clears throat> sorry about that. I apologize. Um, yeah, he, he, Joel is such a good guy. Um, gearing up to start making my own content as well. Fantastic. Words of wisdom. Um, well, uh, definitely, um, what I would say is you don't need to have the best stuff to start. That's my first thing. So, um, yes, I had a DSLR, ca DSLR camera. Um, I bought that such a long time ago. Um, that would have been like, well, I'm older now. <laughs> um, when I started my channel was October 2017. Um, when I bought that camera would have been maybe my 29th birthday or something. So it was a few years old. Let's just say the camera was a few years old. Um, I didn't have a camera stand. I didn't have lighting. Um, I used to have to wait. If you've been following me for a while, um, you will know that I um, used to just film um, on my dining room table and use natural light that would come in um, and have to wait for those moments to do unboxings and stuff. I'd, I'd of course do my games room, but all of that was shot um, purely on a DSLR, which was mainly, it was really just a camera camera, but um, I used to stretch the video, like make sure that, you know, the video was done. So my first thing is whether you've got a phone that takes video, um, you have a DSLR or you can afford to buy yourself a camera, don't be scared to start with just your basics. 
um, until I received like got to a thousand subscribers I don't think I'd bought myself lights by then um, I didn't have a 4k camera um, like a, a proper handy cam um, and I also didn't show myself so do not be scared to um, start creating something um, yeah like don't let anything stop you um, that's my first thing yeah it's it used to I spend too much money this year yeah no I have invested now um, so um, so that's my first bit is uh, I hate this stage I always miss and especially this verse this is not the jumping's a little bit different than the PlayStation 1, so yeah, I need to... No wonder why they give you a life at the beginning of this map, because yeah, it sort of sucks. Um, so yeah, that's my first bit of advice. Um, whatever you have to record yourself, don't be scared to try. Um, oh shit. Damn it. Do not be, don't do not be put off. You can you can record on anything. Uh, just try and make it as clear as possible. And the other thing to make sure is, um, if when you are recording, this goes for anybody that's listening. Um, if you want to record for YouTube, make sure it is always landscape. So if you are going to use your phone, make sure you're recording like this. Um, only because. When I first started, I didn't think of certain things when I was recording, possibly when I was in Japan or something. And I was more, I am more comfortable shooting portrait. But just remember, burn that in your brain, landscape, um, IGTV, try to make it portrait. Um, but that's just another tip. Um, but IGTV is just in the baby stages. So go, go, I know, I know, I'm going to go, I'm going to go, I'm going to go. Yeah, so um, that's the other thing as well, Abby. Um, your camera phones, like Gary said, are much better than they have ever been. Um, so yeah, and a lot of people, um, people that I follow, if, like now as well. Ah, oh, this fucking stone. A lot of people that I follow um, still use their phones. They have iPhones or um, really good Android phones. My phone is an Oppo. Um, and you will notice that I really don't use, um, I don't use it for recording. Um, only, oh, fuck. Only because the quality isn't that great on my phone. I just, but then again, um, you know, I did invest in a camera this year, so. Hundred percent, like MNX said. There are heaps that shoot. Oh my god, this this level. I'm gonna concentrate for a minute, guys. I'm gonna concentrate. Um, but I, I definitely will read that. Abby, please don't uh, leave the chat. I will answer it if there's any more questions in there. Um, there's some. There's a video that I'm gonna be working on. Oh shit, you idiot. <laughs> there's a video I'm working on for my um. We did it for my 4K um, benchmark. Can I jump on this one? Oh no, you can't. There's one that you do start on the. Anyway, not even gonna, not even gonna worry about it. I'm gonna have to end up doing a continue anyway on this. Jesus. me out. Why did they design this game so hard at these levels? Why? Um, okay. Abby, thank you so much for the great advice. I actually have um, long background video production. Oh, awesome. Well, then that's so good. 
anxiety yes um that's something that everyone uh, and and I I do believe that everyone has a little bit of that from time to time so you're never alone um you know even for me like um I'm definitely looking back at some of my older videos compared to now and how um I'm much more comfortable um and it oh fuck and it does happen you become more comfortable um or you could you know start off like I did and not necessarily show yourself to begin with like there's you know ways you can create really creative unboxing videos or um uh, voiceovers reviews um that you don't need to show yourself and yeah like it's I I think um oh sh uh, what it came down to as well, um, when I first uh, started and I hit 1K, um, somebody did reply to me on one of my videos and they said, um, you know, hey, Retro Gamer Girl, um, would you start showing yourself or something so you can connect more with your audience? And I suppose I didn't really think about it at that stage in that way. Oh, shit, this pig's going to kill me. So yeah, um, that's one of the reasons why I did decide to start showing myself as well. But there are a lot of big channels um, that do not show their faces. Um, there's one guy that does unboxing videos that I really enjoy. I can't think of his name, but he always wears white gloves, if you guys have seen him. Um, and I love watching his videos. And he doesn't show himself. doesn't matter. It's about the content. And he's, you know what I mean? So yeah. No, you're not distracting me. I'm just, I've always been terrible at this stage. Um, yeah, look, a lot of people still use their phone for recording um, and also taking Instagram photos. Um, I do occasionally with my Oppo, um, but I do prefer the um, SLR. But I'm going to be um, doing a bit of an overhaul on my Instagram coming into Christmas because I'll have a little bit more time um during the day so yeah i'm i've got i like natural light um to to shoot photos <laughs> yeah look everybody can have confidence issues anxiety um you know trust me i've gone through moments where you know i've cried about things um, you know, I've let the anxiety or the feeling of I'm not good enough, like overwhelm me. Um, so i it does get better, but, um, it's, it's really about believing in yourself and having a good structure of people around you, um, as well, like family or friends, um, you know, that like, you know, help you with those things too. So yeah. <laughs> yep i think be yourself also helps massively um do jeez yeah i try white glove guy i know but i know i don't know what his channel name is i can't think of what his channel name is i'm so terrible with that jump on the ropes oh is there a cheat for that can i jump on the ropes i'm gonna friggin try it that's for sure oh <sighs> But yeah, everyone does have a little bit um, of anxiety or self-doubt. Um, anyone that, like everyone can uh, have so much confidence, but then, you know, sometimes uh, still have that self-doubt stuff as well, so. comes down to how you can react to situations as well um you know if <gasps> oh my god blah 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 <laughs> some people um okay all right i'm gonna jump on the ropes yeah um the other thing as well when you do put yourself out there um some people judge 
as well um, and it's something that you do need to be prepared for as well. But for every person that judges or may or may not be like maybe nasty, um, you'll have 100 that won't be and that they will you know chat to you like you guys are doing now and have conversations and be part of the community and um, genuinely show an interest in you and um, if you do do a video and they didn't seem to like it or the music at least they'll give you something constructive to talk about in like I think that's the main thing so for every one there's a hundred more that are gonna love you so you've got to keep that in mind as well Hey Chaos Engine, how you doing? Thank you so much, um, Abby. Yeah, like, of course, like, it, not every, not every um, video I do. Um, yeah, there was, there's been a couple where I may have done like a short intro and then I do a voiceover video. Um, one of those videos I was actually um, having a lot of anxiety about releasing. Um, you know, I had been trolled um, really bad, I think, the week leading up to that video. Um, and my confidence was knocked a little bit. Um, not something I would always talk about. We just seem to be rolling into that at the moment. And I don't definitely don't like negativity or talking about negativity and stuff but it is part of it and um, you know uh, it's all like I said before it's all about how oh I did it oh it's all about how you react to the situation as well um, but I definitely don't want it to affect me um, in the future so um, yeah I'm oh fuck I should have just gone on the road um yeah, it's one of those things. The relaxing end, awesome. How are you, Joshy boy? Um, good evening. It's good morning for me, but good evening for yourself. How long have you been streaming? I've got to drive somewhere for about 25 minutes. Yeah, I'll be here for a while. Oh, Billy. Billy, I will be here for a while. I'll probably go be right back to get myself a coffee, guys, shortly. Um, but I'm not going anywhere. Let's just have some fun. Let's talk. Let's talk about games. Let's talk about exciting stuff. Let's talk about Christmas. Let's talk about positivity. And uh, Crash Bandicoot as well. Fuck, I'm down to one life again. Zero lives. M. I need to make sure I get onto these ropes. I did it before. Oh, well. Oh. Okay, I'm going to be more confident with this rope thing. I'd love to get past it on this life. <gasps> Shit, I fell off. Yeah, cool, no problem. Oh, thank you. Um, and it's a pleasure to talk about this stuff with, with um, yourself and everyone else. Um, if you want to listen, hey, <laughs> like if everyone wants to listen, um, yeah, it is a pleasure. Uh... I'll, I'll try and cover some of this stuff um, in a positive way in a 4K, like in a, an upcoming video as well. Um, did you see that? No, I haven't. Um, I'm so sorry. I haven't, uh, at, like, as you guys already know, like, I just got home really late last night from. Um, Sydney and I have not had a chance to go through and and you guys know I do I reply to everything on YouTube um, I have not had an honest chance to go through anything I just wanted to jump on stream and um, have a chat with you guys so um, and get back to my schedule so I'm so sorry um, that I haven't replied to that yet oh. <laughs> um, I will get back to you the Soldier Boy console. Oh my god. Um, you know what? It is pretty funny you say that. Um, I I watched a video on it. Oh fuck, that one falls through. Why does that one fall through on me every time? Um, I haven't looked up where you get it from, but god, it looks like 
I don't even know what to call it. He just... <laughs> I have no idea what to think about it. Um, someone did a video on it the other day, and I did check it out. Um, and yeah, I was blown away by it. I don't even know how he got away. How did that even happen? Like, did someone just say they want to put his name towards something and pay him a royalty, or, or what? Like, because it doesn't look very good. Oh yeah, look. If, if I got sent one, um to look at, pull apart, review, maybe. Um, I don't really like stuff like that, like the aftermarket things. Um, but just because it's so relevant in the news, I probably would pull it apart and have a look inside it for sure um, at the components. Yeah, it's the AliExpress. Cause I, I know, but that's why I'm, I thought to myself, I'm like, who put, who, who, why did he allow his manager? Or, like surely he would have a manager or something that wouldn't put, oh, I almost died then. Wouldn't put your name to something like that, maybe? <laughs> oh, he is. Look, that doesn't, that wouldn't surprise me. Um, yeah, for copyright, that's crazy. Um, one of the other things I'm, working on is a this week in news um so yeah this, <laughs> that's in my email to write um a little bit about for a news segment so yeah i'll be shooting that video tomorrow i've got about three videos to shoot tomorrow um yeah oh is he starting esports now wow he's kid <laughs> he's just a kid with the dream Oh, you said I love the 90s. That I did see that, like, because I've, I've gone through my emails, but I, ta I star them in Google, like in uh, Gmail, to reply. So if it's a, I did see some, something in the um, description of the email. I love 90s. I love the 90s. I'm pretty sure that's what you may have said. That's crazy. You can get it from AliExpress for 100 and he's charging like 300 $300? And people are paying that? Oh, yeah. If Nintendo go after him, or any of those massive, like any of the developers could too. Um... Oh, no. Don't say that, Nicholas. Don't. Yeah, all the companies, all the companies, if your game is on there, um, yeah, like you own the rights to it. Same subject, um, but it's more about YouTube um, copyright licensing issues. Um, I can't monetize, oh, 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 I can't monetize um, the Crash Bandicoot. Um, live streams because maybe the music or the licensing and that sometimes happens with games but at least you know a live stream and it doesn't bother me like monetizing is just one of those things you know <laughs> oh, no. so there must be more because I did watch one guy's video on it the other day um, and yeah he, he I don't know if he's pulled it apart yet because I want to see what's in there um, not as good techno <laughs> Yeah, that's a good point, Chaos Engine. Oh, thank God. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> oh, fuck. Fudge. I'm scared if I get on those side of those ropes, I'm just going to fall off anyway. Oh, 
Oh shit! Tricky. I don't think I can do it. <gasps> oh! Oh shit! I'm playing this levels terribly. This is like when I got stuck on the Rue the other day, the big Rue guy. Spawn wave is open. One essentially is a tiny board with a big plastic. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have to look that up. Oh, so it's got a, a pie knockoff in it. Yeah. Wow. I'm just reading all the comments. Sorry, guys. Sometimes I try to... I like to read them, like, twice, so I'm just, like, sinking what what uh, everyone said. So, yeah. <laughs> I've had enough practice now. Hopefully I can get through this. Oh, shit! been talked about a lot though that um that soldier boy thing yeah um i had uh seen a news article i think nicholas about that as well oh jesus christ Uh, don't know which country, but was selling modded PS3s. Does so anyone remember that on eBay? And they got in trouble too? I think. Personally, um, I know that that stuff can be done, but I'm all for just the original way that it came out. Um, do you know what I mean? Like, I'd never, I'd never thought to do anything like that. Like, yes... The original PS1 my hubby has from when he was a teenager was modded, like it had a mod chip or something, but, you know, like we're talking about like that's in the 90s, like, but I would never ever, I've never done anything like that. Oh, this fucking pig! Oh, okay, there you go. I didn't know that. I didn't know. So, yeah, I remember when I was a kid, um, when I'd drive, like, oof, I was not driving, but I'd always remember um, there were signs out the front of, like, um, video record, like, um, oh, video repair centres and stuff. Oh, for fuck's sake. Um, sorry if anyone's watching this with their kids. I'm sorry. I, I definitely always try not to swear in my videos, but this is frustrating the hell out of me. Oh, shit. Yeah, video record centers. That's what I was trying to say. Um, repair centers and stuff used to have like mod chip your PS1 and stuff like that. Like even when I was a kid, I remember seeing those signs. Um, it used to be a huge thing here in Australia. Do you remember that, Nicholas? There's even a place in Brisbane that's closed down that still has the sign. When I drive past there one time, I'll take a photo, I'll put it on Instagram. 
Oh. 80s and Aussie Kiss. Definitely far out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah crazy hey it was really big um i don't know how big it is now obviously but i'm probably showing my age but uh yeah it was really big um years and years ago um just something i never i'd never done uh, personally, but yeah, there's just uh, some games that I can't afford that I would possibly consider doing uh, it on. Um, one is Harmful Park. I really want that game on PS1, the Japanese. Oh, I just I have never played it. I watch gameplay videos. Um, that's the other thing. Like, I know I could somehow get around doing it, but I just love playing the original stuff. Like, there's nothing that will change me on that. Like, so yeah, I've never played it. Oh, shit, this... I keep making the same mistake again. Same mistake. Same mistake. Has anyone heard of Harmful Park? In here. Oh, this fucking thing. <sighs> yeah, it wouldn't surprise me. Crash Bandicoot from... Yes, Stefan. Who doesn't? Um, I played this game. I have um, the Japanese version. I have PAL version too, but... Oh, fucking hell. Wow. Um, but yeah, just for convenience sake, um, and I, I, I've played the original one a lot. Um, I wanted to finish it um, on Peaceful. So I thought I'd play it on here. How good is the Sony Trinitron though? In the house are the best. Old school. I've got like a little um, 14. Oh, maybe it's bigger than 14. Maybe... I don't know if you've seen my games room tour, but there's like a smaller silver one. I don't know if it's it's bigger than 14 inches. It's maybe a 16. It's so good. I love that TV. Oh, did it. <sighs> yeah, it's a cute em up. Yeah, shmup. Cute em up, shmup. So good. Need that too. Yeah, it's so good, and mate. This one. Wow. I didn't even know you could do that, Gary, either. See, I'm so, like, in the in the dark about that stuff. Oh! I don't know whether to try and jump up on the thing again. Yeah, Radical Reggie does have it. I really want it. Oh, I'm never going to get past this. All right, concentration cap on next time. Um, no, I know. I know you're joking. I know you're a huge fan of Reggie. I know that's a joke. Um, yeah, I uh, had my hands on a copy in Japan. Um, there's a game store in Akihabara called Friends, um, and we had our hands on a copy of it, but the cover... It was about $400 Australian converted, and that would have been three trips ago, so maybe a year and a half, two years ago now, probably. And the cover, I don't know, because it was the only one I've ever seen before, the cover looked a little bit faded, like it had been in the, you know when you have display and the box fade and stuff? But I don't know if that's actually the cover of the game. Um, so, yeah, uh, it's... 
I didn't end up getting it, but um, sorry, I'm just going to quickly read through this. My first games on the PS1 were Salt Rigs, um, a Tekken, yes, Tekken 2, later on Syndicate Wars, Time Crisis, uh, yeah, I love Time Crisis. Um, one of my first PS1 games was Crash Bandicoot Zero Divide, which not a lot of people, I don't know if a lot of people have heard of it. Um, it's like, um, they're like robot, it's a fighting game. Um, but it's probably not one of the best fighting games, but I still love Zero Divide because it was one of my favorite, um, one of my first games when it was released here in Australia. So it was one of my first, um, but I never had the time crisis home stuff when I was growing up. I used to rent point blank and time crisis, uh, in the gun. I remember it used to be in like a, uh, from Blockbuster, like a black case with the gun and the foam and off. Oh, I loved, I loved renting that. Like that was like my treat um, when I was a teenager, being able to get that. So yeah, that was so good. My dad used to take me to Blockbuster and we'd rent that. Um, I'm going to make myself a coffee, um, guys. So, um, hey, uh, AJ, um, J Ajax, um, how are you? Thank you for joining and thank you for also saying hello. Uh, also, thank you to the other 15 viewers we have in here at the moment. Uh, it's amazing. Thank you so much. Don't forget to hit the uh, subscribe button to my channel. Um, I'll have three whopping videos coming out next week and I stream Tuesday to Friday and then over on Twitch on weekends. But um, yeah, just definitely hit the subscribe button. But I'm going to go make myself a coffee. So I'm going to hit the B right back. Um, don't leave. We're going to get past this level. It keeps kicking my my butt but we are going to do it so um, I'll be two minutes about that 
um, thank you very much for staying here. Um, <clears throat> we dropped off, a dropped off a few, um, but let's get back into it. All right. Um, okay, I'll definitely have a look. Um, that's pretty cheap. Never owned Crash Bandicoot. I did own all the demo discs, so yeah. Um, you know, one of my favourite things to collect for, um, and my husband also really loves it too, um, are demo discs. Um, there is just so much n n nostalgia um, in those demo discs. Like, do you remember when they have, like, demo written on them, the PS1 ones, and they're, like, in the cardboard? Uh, I hope you guys may have got those ones too. Um, and there's, like bright orange or like sort of I don't know there's something so special about them so um, we've got a pretty good collection oh no not a good one like probably got like oh shit I don't know how many we'd have now we'd have a few um, and sometimes when I shoot a video you guys might see um, if I have the PS1 on I always put demo discs in the background um, like it's all those little things that I do in my videos as well, like that I just, I don't know, I just love. And when people comment and they're like, oh, that demo disc's on the background or whatever, like I know that people will like see all the other things that I sort of do in the videos. Like everything down to like grey nail polish or like red nail polish when I did the Spider-Man video, um... Yeah, like I try, try and put little Easter eggs in videos sometimes, so just keep an eye out for those. Um, have I missed something here? Hang on, sorry. Oh, uh, I don't know um, him, uh, MNX, but... Um, I have what I just subscribe to his channel and I watch his videos when I some like when I catch up on videos, but I don't know much about him at all. So, um, I must have missed what you guys are talking about completely, but um, I did see Joel's video. Um, everyone approaches their YouTube channels completely differently um, and you know some people receive stuff um, from you know game developers or um, companies you know like Xbox or PlayStation or whatever um, and then some people do make their living from um, you know Patreon and uh, content creation in other ways so yeah I don't I I don't know, um, I did see that though. I think it's more like if people do come across as begging, I don't know. Um, I didn't see anything about beat-em-ups ripping into Joel. Um, that has obviously gone right over my head. Yeah, and um, yeah, I, Joel did not mention anybody in particular. Yeah, that's right. Um, that has all gone over my head, guys. Sorry, I, I, I must have... Uh, I did see Joel's video though, and I thought it was a good video. Um, but yeah, I didn't see anything else about it. So there you go. Shows how much I'm in the know. Um, I I pretty much really religiously um, watch Joel's videos. My friend Gemma, um, the Gebs24. I'm sure you guys have heard of her. She is one of the most amazing people um, I've ever had the pleasure of meeting online um, and I just absolutely love um, love her content so I watch Gemma's videos all the time um, Pixel Game Squad uh, and then I have my uh, good friend Gundam Russ Gaming and uh, Russ's channel is awesome I watch his videos religiously um, another channel um, Two Busy Gamers uh, Neil's channel is one of my favourites, um, and along with uh, the PSX collector Simon, he's also a very good friend of mine. So I watch those three Aussie guys religiously, along with Joel. So there's four Aussies and me. I don't watch my own videos back, but you know what I mean. Um, and then uh, Gemma, uh, Pixel, 
sometimes and then everyone else I catch up on when I get time. So yeah. But I didn't I don't watch a lot of beat em ups. Uh, that tune, um, it is, I'll have to work out what the name of it is, um, and it's on Epidemic Sound, but I can't remember the name of the song on my thing, so yeah. Billy jumped on Joel. Billy, who's Billy? Mmm, coffee, yeah. Yeah, I know. I, I just keep sucking with that box thing. Um, I still don't know exactly what happened. Oh, Game Chaser. Billy. Oh, Game Chaser's Billy. Sorry. Yes. My apologies. Um, yeah. Well... The thing is, everybody has their content um, and creation for uh, different purposes and, you know, some people can come across uh, differently to others and stuff, but um, yeah, I just always go for positivity. Um, I'm subscribed to all of them. Um, clearly, I have missed something along the lines here from you guys chatting about it, but at the end of the day, like, hopefully it's all sorted out between all of them and we can go back to, like, being positive and not have to worry about it. There's enough people that don't like people playing video games. We should be a community together supporting one another and, you know, maybe not taking everything maybe so seriously um, because at the end of the day, you know, we're sort of... Gaming's not, you know, something... Well, I'm sure a lot of... I used to get picked on for playing games all the time, so... And being a nerd. Oh, shit! We should all be more supportive to, to one another, I definitely think. <gasps> shit! Um, no, I, I haven't, um, tried Facebook marketplaces in saying that though, um, I know of a lot of people, um, especially in Victoria, um, that do really well from Facebook marketplace as in finding stuff and not just, fuck, oh, this fucking state. we're going to be on here for an hour. Actually, we have been playing this stage for an hour. Besides me stopping for a coffee. Um, and for Prime Minister, maybe. Maybe one day. If I could get them all in a room together, that would be great. Try and get everybody talking. We already have enough people that are against us in the world. That don't like gamers. We shouldn't be against each other. And everyone's going to have a different way of doing their channel and creating it. And that's the beauty of the internet. Um, but yes, back on Facebook marketplaces. Um, it's it's definitely uh, huge. Um, I don't use Facebook. Um, it's I never have. Um, so I, I have enough uh, poisons with... Um, oh! Uh, social media with uh, Instagram, Twitter and YouTube which I'm on almost full time so uh, yeah I oh 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 this um, but yeah you guys let me know have you found a lot of good stuff oh for fuck's sake
Sorry, I've got my concentration face on now. I can feel myself, like, squinting. Oh, that was not fair. I hit jump. I'm really stuck at this stage. Ah! Nice. That's so good. Um, Xbox 360 kiosk. That's amazing. I'd love a kiosk. That's good. All those, pi like, PS2 lot. That's fantastic for that price. Yeah, look. Uh, honestly, I know. Oh, no. One pound. Really? That's crazy. Um, yeah, no, it's really good. I, I know that there are a lot of people that um, do jump on it um, and have had some amazing deals. Um, I think a friend of mine um, who's uh, on Instagram, uh, he ended up... Oh, this is shit, by the way. I'm trying to... I'm doing the rails next. Yeah, I know. Um, Ajix, I'm sucking so bad at this one too. I'm um, so thank you to everybody that keeps sitting here and watching me fail at this. Um, I reckon oh, Billy's going to come back in here and be like, are you still on the same level? Ugh, I'm so silly. Yes, I am still on it. Uh, oh, shit. I don't think my fingers are talking to me to my brain correctly. Alright. I think I've got some of these down pat, but the next I need to start working on walking on the thing. Ah, uh, yeah, sorry. So, my friend, he messaged me and said um, he picked something up. And he took all the Nintendo stuff, but he asked me if I wanted the PlayStation stuff. And it was a rip he did me a ripper deal. I think I paid like 125 or something. Um, some of the games didn't have, like the PSP games were missing and a couple of the PS3 games were missing. But it still had, it still ended up having an original Xbox console in there, a slim PS2, a PS3, um, I can't remember what model it was. It must, I think it was a super slim. Um, and then a bunch of games. And honestly, I didn't have one of those games. So I was like really happy um, with it. But yeah, it was a shame that, that some of the PSP games weren't in there. One was called The Third Birthday, which is um, Parasite Eve 3 um, of, on PSP. And I was spewing that that one was missing. But uh, I'm trying really hard to find the actual game disc. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we swear. I know. Yeah, I agree, Chaos. Um, Joel has uh, some amazing contacts and friends that he's obviously made over the years. Damn it. Uh, and he has some beautiful, beautiful stuff in his collection. Um, nor would I. Um... He's just so knowledgeable as well, uh, down to earth. Um, I can't speak highly enough uh, about Joel. Shit! Fucking hell. Oh my god! I'm getting so frustrated now. Can someone please... Can I phone a friend? Oh, shit. I absolutely suck at this. Hey, jo uh, Jose. Jose? Jose. Um, thank you for joining and also saying hello. Um, GameCube. Oh, nice. Uh, that game would be worth, like, at least $80, wouldn't it? 
Hello, ha, Unreal Bex Supersuds. How are you today? Thank you very much for joining. Yeah. Um, look, I have had some good luck with cash converters. Um, not always. But there are times that I've I've gone there and uh, they've had some PS1 games or um, PSP. I, I do, most of you will also know, um, I love movies and cinema. Uh, and so I have a pretty big collection of UMD movies and I try and grab them um, pretty, pretty much predominantly. They have been pickups from cash converters over a, a long period of time, but uh, I sometimes pick them up for two bucks. Um, but now they have started to increase them to between 5 and 10 for UMD. So it's got to come down to if I really want the movie or not. Like, I'm not going to pay $10 for, I don't know, Mary-Kate Nash or <laughs> something like that. Um, but I might pay $10 for a Predator movie or Terminator or something. So, yeah, it just comes down to the quality of what they've got. Come on. Yeah, it is. Doing... Ah, oh, yes, you're going. When do you fly out? Are you going to fly today or tomorrow? Yeah, um, it's also another tip for cash converters. When you go there uh, and you want to look at um, the dates, if the, date, if the game's been there for quite a while... Um, you can sometimes also say, oh, you know, I see you've had this for a while. Um, and if you combine some stuff together, um, it doesn't happen to me always, but um, they'll sometimes give me like a 5 or 10% discount on a bulk buy. So like, let's say I bought something, $100 worth of stuff, they might give me $10 off or um, 20 cents off each game or something like that. So um, you just got to ask. Um, but yeah, I always check the dates. Yeah, same. I agree. Some are 10, some are 3. It's hit and miss. Um, yeah. <gasps> 10 o'clock. Oh, my God. Yeah, you guys, um, we're going to have, are going to have such an amazing time um, with your family over there. So, oh, I'm so jealous. Shit. I'm really going to rage quit in a minute or just change playing a game. I'm just going to play the other Crash because like, I can't play this for much longer. Do you reckon I can just do this really slow? Oh. I'm going to fall off. Sorry, everyone. <laughs> Concentration is real. I've got to sneeze. <coughs> Bugger. <coughs> Bugger. Oh, my goodness. I'm so sorry. Um... All right, well, good uh, stuff, Chaos Onion. Um, have a lovely day. Enjoy your Christmas shopping. I don't want to go do mine. <laughs> yeah. I agree, and I think most of the time, if you're really, like, polite, friendly, and you're like, oh, hey, you know, like, not like, oh, hey, <laughs> no, don't do it like that, but you know what I mean? Um, I think they do do you a deal, but um, you have a great day, Chaos Engine. Thank you so much for saying hello um, and joining my streams. It's always a pleasure to chat to you. Um, I'll be back on tomorrow, and I'm sure you'll jump on tomorrow and have a chat, so, yeah, we will be back on. I know. I'm doing the rope. I'm doing the rope. I'm doing the rope. I just got to concentrate on it. Okay. I 
I'm like so worried I'm going to die. But we have played this stage for an hour, guys. So, um, and I'm a platform, platformer player, but it's just kicking me butt. Talk amongst yourselves. Just talk amongst yourselves. I'm like shaking a little bit. <sighs> okay, Joshua boy. Uh, hello, retro gamer guy. The husband is in the house. You're back. Oh, Billy, I'm still on the same stage, mate. I'm still on the same map. I actually just said about five minutes ago that when you pop back on, you're going to be like, are you still on the same map? And I, yes, I am. Okay, Gary, uh, you're always up so late. Um, have a good sleep. Uh, I'll talk to you again uh, tomorrow when I jump on. But yeah, always lovely to chat with you as well. How's the PlayStation office? Once you've gotten through this section. Okay. Oh. I don't know if I can get up there from here. Oh, shit. <gasps> oh, shit. There's another pig. This is so shit. Oh! FPV only. Thank you very much for subscribing and joining us, our crazy crew. <gasps> I, I think I need to be more confident with this. I'm going to fall off. I'm so scared I'm going to die. Oh my god. 6.30 US time. Woohoo! I hope you had a great day. It's Thursday night for you, isn't it? Is everyone here? Da 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 da. I know. Oh, 
What's everyone got planned for Christmas? Retro Gamer Guy and I will be playing a lot of VR. Oh, shit. This is a bit fucking pain in the ass. Um. Ah! Oh, I'm gonna throw this controller down. Oh, my God. Oh, shit. Saved it. Yeah, we're going to play um, a little bit of VR over this Christmas break live. Um, I'm just going to uh, buy a copy of Beat Saber uh, today. Get that installing. We're going to have uh, another game. Um, an Atlas game. I'm going to have um, Persona, the dancing one. Tetris Effect. Do you reckon I can jump in there this time? How many lives do I have? Oh my god. Nice. Um, I've always wanted to play Limbo. Has it? Is it on any other platform or is it just PC? Yes. Persona. Okay. And don't forget Tetris Effect. What are we doing here? <gasps> oh my god. Please be the end. I want the end of this stage. <gasps> if that's game over. Oh my god. Oh my god. Um. Oh, it is on PS4. Um, I happen to get a copy on PC, so I didn't know it was on PS4. I'm definitely going to check that out. Yeah, definitely, um, Joshy Boy. That's the same thing we do. I always go with the list. Um, that's something I will cover in a video um, about. I'm going to do a collecting video. Um, it'll be something that'll be released probably at the beginning of 2019. So I'd say within the first week of January. Um, what I plan uh, before I go and what I'm looking at buying for this, you know, for the new year, which won't be much, but uh, I always have collecting goals. I think everyone does. Um, yeah, I'd love to go to Sapporo. Nice. <laughs> I know, Nicholas. Have we talked about Home Alone 1 and 2 already yet? Because we are watching that this evening. Home Alone 1 and 2, and we are going to be playing the DLC for Spider-Man, which won't be live tonight. Um, because that uh, that's actually... That game save is on the PS4 Pro Spider-Man that's on the wall mount in the lounge room. And every time I try to um, stream inside that room, oh, for fuck's sake, I have a huge, huge issues with sound. So, yeah, it was... But we're going to be watching Home Alone for sure. And eating our very old cheese pizza. I'm going to try and be more confident with this map. What do you reckon, guys? Be more confident? I can't believe I was right near the end then, too, and I died twice. Just an FYI, I 
really dislike this stage. Oh, and Beck, sorry, you did ask um, a question about the PlayStation office. Um, yeah, it was an amazing experience uh, to have the opportunity to visit. Um, I was actually just a bit in awe um, of being able to, to go. Um, I didn't pull my phone out. I didn't pull my GoPro out. Um, I just actually enjoyed enjoyed just being there and um, yeah, just, yeah. It's almost really hard to describe um, the opportunity. Like, words like wonderful, um, I, yeah, just, yeah, it was fantastic. Yeah, we always listen to Home Alone too. You did too, you did guess that. Was, I don't even know if that was Christmas last year or it was just during this year, but we still, we always listen to the Home Alone 2 soundtrack. It's one of our favorite, um, movies. Yeah, I want a cheese pizza. I want my very own cheese pizza. Yeah, Home Alone is um, just one of the best um, movies ever. And what's funny is, like, I grew up watching it, loving it. Um, and when um, Retro Gamer Guy and I met... Um, it was just like one of the probably one of the first things we talked about. Like when, when we talk about um, when you meet each other, like meet people for the <gasps> start dating. Um, Home Alone was one thing that came up because we both loved it. <gasps> Same with Hocus Pocus. If you guys have seen that movie, we love that movie too. Huge fans. Oh, good luck, sake. Everybody cheer. That only took an hour and a half <laughs> to get through that map. So thank you to everybody that has um, sat and watched me. And thank you to one of my new subscribers. What a mission. And we're at uh, 10 days to go. Uh, I'm going to try and get uh, to 4,150 subscribers. So if you haven't hit the subscribe button, please do right now. Um, three videos coming out next week, four live streams per week. Um, it's pretty crazy. Um, I look forward to chatting with all of you if you join my streams. Uh, so please hit the subscribe button. I love this stage. So I'm just going to have a quick read. Uh, Pigeon Lady, I know she should have got her own video. I want them to make a Home Alone 3. Seeing that Google ad has given me hope that there will be another Home Alone. I don't know how anyone else feels about that, but I've, I've been hanging on that. Hanging on it. Uh, yes, thank you, Ajix. Thank you, thank you. Congratulations. Take a post because this is a classic. I want it. Um, I want a better version of it um, on the, uh, the steelbook version. Um, yeah, I know. You did say the rope. It worked. 
You're a champion, mate. Yeah, steel book. That's right. There's a steel book version of it. You guys are all chatting. Ah, oh, just too many games. How are you, bro? How are you? You having a good day? Yeah, I know, but they don't count, Nicholas. The only Home Alone's account are one and two. Macaulay Culkin all the way. I'm not watching the other ones. Yeah. That's what I reckon. They do not, they do not, they do not count. I'm sorry. People can argue that, oh yes, there's more. There's not. Love these stages. Crash his face. Now everyone as well, um, I'm not a trophy hunter. Um, we are just playing for the love of the game. You will see me miss multiple boxes um, as well. Oh shit and stuff. Um, no, I don't have Discord. A uh, few people have asked me. It's not something I've actually had the time to look at yet. Um, so yeah, I. I need to look at it. Ask me um, after the Christmas break when you jump onto a stream and I'll let you know if I've, I've done it yet. But no, I haven't done it yet. There's just uh, so little time and so many things to still set up and do, so... Oh shit, a brick! Oh, yes. Oh, my God. That video was like, it changed my life. It was so good. Um, I've been a huge fan of Macaulay Culkin. Um, I love a lot of his um, movies when he was a kid as well. I think he's a great actor. Um, and to see that, like, he was in that video and how funny it was. I love I loved that video. Um, it's, yeah, the what a great 19 minutes if any of you have time to um to watch that video uh it was released about a week ago um it's also something i'm going to talk about in my news uh, ah i stopped i stopped for a second i'm gonna die uh my news video this week i know it's probably like last week's news but it's definitely still pretty funny i love Macaulay. My finger is slipping off the joystick. Oh, it's like barely on there, my thumb. Oh, and I can't stop. Oh, no! My finger was like just barely on it. All right, we gotta get past this, guys. This is, this is serious, this is serious gameplay now. Oh yeah, no, I'll be I'll be still here, Josh. I'll still be here. I might just go and make another coffee, but if you see the be right back, I am coming back. Hopefully this map doesn't take me an hour to pass either. <laughs> yeah, definitely go watch that video. It's so good. Funniest video. Oh! Bow, bow, bow. Deck the halls. Deck the hall. 
Tools deck the halls. I don't know if I've watched that. Who's in it? I don't remember if I've watched that, Nicholas. Deck the halls. Deck the halls. I don't know. I'm going to have to look it up for sure. Shit, my finger keeps slipping off the fucking controller again. And I can't hit the options, but... Okay. 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 Ha ha ha. Alright, I'm just hitting pause. I'm just going to be right back. Sorry, guys. Oh, Tim the Torment Taylor. Um, you have talk boy in one hand. I'm sure you will, bub. Yeah, mention all your favourite... Um, oh... God, that's such a hard question, Stefan. Um, look, you, everyone knows I'm the biggest Donkey Kong Country fan, so... And I'm a huge Crash fan, but... I kind of... I'm going to have to go with... I'm going to have to go with, um... Donkey Kong Country. As probably my favourite platform game. And it's not just the first one like I think that they made three amazing games rare um, at that time you know they yeah and uh, it's funny because I play Donkey Kong Country all the time um, retro gamer guy uh, he didn't um, and every time I play Donkey Kong, I'm like, you got to play them with me. But he, he watches me play them. He's watched me um, play and complete the first Donkey Kong three times this year already. Um, I'd probably play Donkey Kong Country. Um, I'd definitely play it and finish it a couple of times a year. Yeah. I haven't played Ocarina of Time this year to finish. Um, I'm still working through my... Uh, 3DS version. I might try and finish a bit more of that off over Christmas um, just so I've played Ocarina again. Um, I just don't want to forget certain spots in the game and stuff like that. I like to play it like because I've played it so many times that I just remember it through. Russ! My friend Russ is in the house. Gundam Russ Gaming. Please, everybody, if you have not subscribed to his channel, Right click on his name, go to his channel, hit the subscribe, hit the bell icon and give Russ some love. He is an amazing person. Uh, please do do that for me right now. Um, <laughs> yeah, I know. Hey Rob, how are you? Um, thank you very much for joining. I hope you're having a good day. Um, I'm having a great day. 
I think the post is here. All right, guys. I'm sorry. I just got to go grab the post. Sorry, it's all systems go here today. Um, oh, all right, we're back. Whew. Thank you to the 12 awesome. Oh, my camera's now. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, we got it. We got it back. Oh, I got past that one pretty easily, thank God. It, <laughs> it wasn't a bill for once, Russ. <laughs> it was a present from two busy gamers. So if you guys um, haven't subscribed to their channel as well, I'm going to give them a shout out right now. Um, oh my gosh. I love Christmas. We're talking about Christmas movies as well. Um, we're sharing the love from all these awesome channels that I'm friends with as well. Um, so I just got um, a present from my friends, uh, Too Busy Gamers, and I would love it if you would subscribe to their channel. Um, I haven't opened it yet. I will open it, uh, probably as part of my video, because I said I'm doing three videos, so um, yeah, I'm definitely going to do that. Do, 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 do. Um, sorry, Wilson, I'm not sure um, what uh, you've just said. Um, if you can translate that for me. Um, that would be great. Like, please repeat which channel. Oh, Too Busy Gamers. So I've just posted a link to Too Busy Gamers um, and Russ's channel to make it just that little bit easier for you guys. Here we go. Translate. Google. Oh, thank you very much, um, Wilson. Uh, Wilson said, congratulations for a very good video. Um, thank you very much for subscribing and watching my channel. Um, I'll do my best in between uh, gaming if you do comment and say something else, um, I'll just convert this quickly, but then I'm going to have to get back into this game. Wilson? Ah, good Christmas and a happy hug. Thank you. Wishing you a very Merry Christmas as well. Um, and I'm, I'm so sorry that I can't... Um, that is pretty... I'm so, so sorry um, that I, I just can't speak Portuguese, but um, is, it, is it Portuguese? Um... So yeah, I'm 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 really sorry. If I could, I would. I'd love to. Um, all right. Uh, yes, Unreal Bex and Super Suds. Uh, now these these two guys are uh, so like couple. Um, Beck and Suds like are so super lovely. Uh, they're based in Australia as well. Um, and I'd really love it if you guys could subscribe to their channel. What you'll do is just click on the name and go to their channel and hit subscribe. So TJ Movies is in the house. How are you? And it is. Die Hard is a classic Christmas movie. Um, I pissed myself laughing when, um, if you guys have or haven't watched the roast of Bruce Willis, 
And at the very end, he ends it with um, confirming that Die Hard is not a Christmas movie. I found that very funny. Yes, definitely. Um, support the Aussie YouTube community. Um, we are a growing community. Um, and there are some amazing people that are within there that um, I that have been so kind to me, so lovely and supportive. Um, and you know, everyone has their busy day, day to day life. But if I need something or just a question or to check a video of mine before it goes live, um, helping me secure games that I might not have. Um, the list goes on, um, or even just sometimes having a chat because sometimes not everyone has the best days. Um, I can guarantee that the people that um, have been really lovely to me are all Australian gamers, and I'm very blessed. Um, so, yeah, I think we should be supporting... <gasps> Damn it! Supporting each other a lot more. Oh, yes! I have Die Hard on Blu-ray um, as well, and I'll be watching Die Hard. Um, I have we, Retro Gamer Guy and I have um, one video, one movie we always watch Christmas Eve, which is Christmas Vacation. It's my favourite Christmas movie. Um, so, oh, okay. Home Alone one and two are definitely up there as my Christmas movies, um, but I love Christmas Vacation. Um, I just, I always have. So yeah, it's it's our Christmas night movie. Um, and I think, I think I'll plan out when we're going to be watching our movies um, as well. Because I want to make sure we have enough time to watch all of them. Ba, 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 ba. Definitely needed that life. Oh, these guys. <sighs> oh, so lucky. going on here. Definitely need those lives. Couldn't have come at a better time. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let's do this. Okay. Normally if you hear me go one, two, one, two, it's just me getting the rhythm of the game. I will do it no matter what. I've always done it since I was a kid. Yeah, National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation is my favourite. The shit is full. <laughs> it's just got so many jokes in it. And I think when I watched that as a kid, um, I just remember like always thinking it was just so funny. And Chevy Chase is so funny. these bats gonna come. Don't push me off. <sighs> okay. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Whop! Shit! You can't hit him from the front. Oh, that's so good. Um, they had that on sale, didn't they? That J, uh, JB had that on sale. The um, 
the box set or something like that. Because I think... I think Retro Gamer Guy sent it to me, but I already have, like, don't get me wrong, I'm all for buying another box set, but I've had those Blu-rays for ages, so I didn't, um, I didn't end up buying the box set because I already had them. It wouldn't be the first time I've bought multiples of something, though. <gasps> Shit! I hate that guy. I can see this stage being a pain in the ass for me to get through, too. I'm holding my controller really high up too, guys. I don't normally game like this, but I'm just like... SHIT! Making a mess of me, this dude. I'll get it. I'll get it right. I'll get it right at some point. This might take me an hour. I was so lucky. Hi, how are you, Titan007? And hello from Australia. Um, all right, MNX. Uh, yes, um, thank you very much for joining. Merry Christmas. I'm sure I will catch you again um, either from when I upload a video because you always uh, jump on, watch, and comment. Uh, but, yeah, I'll catch up with you again beforehand. But thank you very much for all your support this year and Merry Christmas to you as well if we don't talk. I, I want arcade one up from Capcom Vision. I haven't looked at that. I have to have a look. I'm off to get. Oh! Should have done that a bit quicker. Oh no! Eep. Eep, eep, eep. I just timed that wrong. I'm going to have to concentrate. Um, I'm off to get some VR, other VR games today. And uh, as I said, I'm going to uh, download Beat Saber um, today, so I'll get on to that. Ah, oh, fuck. I think there is a couple of other games um, that I really wanted to try on VR, so... I don't know about getting the impatient. Um, maybe. Looks pretty scary. Has anyone tried the impatient? Oh, the PlayStation office was, uh, yeah, unreal. Um, unreal experience uh, to, to go. Um,
amazing uh, opportunity that we were, we were able to. Um, I didn't take any photos or video, uh, obviously. It was... Oh, shit, how do I get through here? All right, I'm just going to have to wait now for the next... Um, yeah, it was such a great opportunity. Um, I wish I had have taken a couple of photos, um, but my... My hubby has, so um, they're on his Instagram. So if you just go to uh, Instagram and uh, follow him at retro.gamer.guy and uh, you'll see some awesome photos. Bloody bats. Oh, thank God. Is that one going to fall? That one's going to fall! No, 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 no. I lost my concentration for a second. Um, yeah, you've seen the photos. <laughs> I know. Uh, a few people have uh, reached out and said, oh, so jealous. But um, it just, it happened last minute. Um, it was not like really pre-planned or anything like that so um as i said it was just an opportunity um of a lifetime for us so yeah it was amazing um and russ you ate a whole packet of barbecue shapes that's crazy i could eat a whole i could eat a whole box too i could eat multiple boxes i love them <laughs> i love that Oh no, I stuffed it. Oh, Billy, you need to get into that PlayStation Classic. It is awesome. I'm not doing it this time. I swear I stuffed it last time. I'm going to get stuck into some Metal Gear Solid on the PlayStation Classic as well in the Christmas break, or over over the Christmas break, should I say. Good. Shit! <sighs> this stage sucks. Sucks. Is there a thing in there? Let's see the other one. All right. And these stages just seem to get longer and longer. Hopefully I don't make the same mistakes I was making before. Mistakes. I'm not doing the counting thing! 
I'm definitely going to play Resident Evil on the classic, but mostly Metal Gear Solid. I'm really looking forward to knuckling down into that game. That's something Retro Gamer Guy and I will play together as well. I just want to get past the stage. Shit. Alright. Donating to the stream. I'm gonna put that money towards a new VR game today. Ah! I jumped around that. Oh my god, that was tricky. It was tricky, tricky, tricky. That was awesome. Hope everyone's seen that. I am gonna make a highlight out of that one. <gasps> Woo! Thank you, Russ. We're gonna go a bit crazy on the VR. Guys and girls watching, don't forget to subscribe and come and join us while we play VR with the family over the Christmas holidays. method to this madness. Oh, it wasn't this one. It wasn't that one. It wasn't that one. It wasn't that one. It was the next one. Oh, Billy! Thank you very much for donating! You are a champion! It's going to go to the PSVR collection. So I'll be buying another game today online. I'm downloading Beat Saber. Um, so thank you very much, guys, for that. It's going to go towards that game. Um, I'm buying Astro Bot Rescue Mission as well. Going to be looking forward to playing. Oh, go, go, go. Uh, playing all those games this Christmas. What's everyone ask for Christmas? What do you guys want to get yourselves for Christmas? Oh, Nicholas, are you going okay? I'll talk to you later, mate. Um, shit. I was so lucky then. Oh, no. What am I doing? Oh, I got it. That jump was actually a little bit hard then. Another checkpoint. Thank God. Oh, this guy. Yeah, what does everyone want for Christmas? Have you asked for anything uh, from Santy? That was going to fall then, or something, and I hadn't timed it right. <sighs> oh, my God! I don't think I can run through that. Whoa, 
stupidity. You're gonna get yourself a TV. Nice. I didn't really think about Christmas presents this year. Not sure if I'll be on last year later. Yes, yeah, same to you, um, Nicholas. I, f I don't speak to you again. Have a very Merry Christmas. Whoa. Shit! Yeah, we decided um, we don't normally buy Christmas presents. Um, like we do, um, but like just smaller sort of things. Um, always like a funny gift or something like that. Um, but this year we decided, no, we've obviously um, went to the Australian Games Awards. Um, it was one big thing um, and sort of like a present to both of us. Uh, but we really, really want to... Um, play heaps of VR, so. I don't know how I'm going to do this. <gasps> I don't know how to get past it. Shit. What have we got? Sorry for the silence, guys. I'm in the don't want to die mode. Oh! Oh! Oh, my God. Make that checkpoint. Alright, I'm gonna have to watch this one. Oh my god. <sighs> Shit, I was like not on the right thing. Hi, Sylvia. Thank you very much for joining. Jump on top of the blocks. Yes, I know. I worked that out at the last minute. Um, a Yamaha. Nice. I can imagine that would be maybe a little bit expensive, but still. Oh, that was pure luck. <laughs> All right, pure luck that was. I just seen Yamaha and I thought it probably would be expensive. Oh! <laughs> Bow. Bow! Oh, nice. That's alright though. 500's not bad. Okay, thank you very much, Russ, for joining. Um, and yeah, thank you very much for your donation to my, or to our. <laughs> VR. Uh, um, collection. 
Yeah, and Russ, when I are you on next? You're gonna have to tag me in Instagram when you are. Um, I have notifications turned on for your channel, but I don't seem to get the emails, which is really weird. Um, and I know someone else uh, told me that that sort of happens with my channel too for them, so I don't know what the deal is with that. Come on. Lives. Woo! We got there. We got there in the end. Do, 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 do. Shit. Oh, shit. Don't die. I do slightly get relieved when I see the checkpoint, I won't lie. Shit. <gasps> Alright. I have to time this right. I might count, guys. Oh! Come on, be the ending. Oh, Jesus. I can't believe that. Two, one, two. Shit. Start again. <sighs> oh, yes. It's a bloody lizard. Almost got all the boxes, it looks like. I oh, missed one. Damn it! Oh, I got a trophy! Woohoo! Okay, no problem, Russ. Oh! Thanks, though, Billy, for that. I'll have to double check that, because, yeah, I do miss stuff out. Koala Kong. I don't remember how to beat this dude. Look at his tight little buns. Ah, uh, I can't pick them up, can I? Oh, do I hit them back towards him? I can't remember, I can't remember. Shit, he just nailed me with that. Shaking your booty. Oh. How do I do this one? Do I have to wait for a rock to be thrown at the box? Maybe. Pew. Damn it. Jesus. Really crazy. There we go. I remember now. I knew we had to spin something at him. Fuck, those rocks come at you pretty quick. direct hit then it was like it hit the crate first or the cart that one was oh shit 
Wah. Da. Shit. Some of these bosses. Uh, no problem, my Billy. See you later. Thank you very much for joining, and thank you for my donation. Uh, be put towards a VR game. A special shout out at Christmas uh, when we play that game uh, to O'Billy and Gundam Russ for their donations this morning. Um, and thank you everyone that's joined and chatting. I hope you're having a great day or night wherever you are. Thank you very much for joining me and watching me play one level for over an hour and a half because I sucked at it. But we're going alright now. I just need to time this right to get this big koala bear. Uh, just an FYI, everyone as well. Our koalas are not like this. But they are exceptionally cute. Throw it here. Throw it about here. Throw it about here. No! Bad timing. It took me a while to get the kangaroo the other day too, actually. I'd, I had to memorize the um, pattern. Um, but yeah, the kangaroo took me like half an hour. Clearly a bit rusty. Let's do this. Direct hit. Yeah, he throws his brick, uh, his rocks fast at you. I don't know where to stand. I don't know where to stand. I don't know where to stand. Shit. Alright, one more. Don't die, Em. Don't die. Oh, shit. Come on. Oh! Oh! That was so lucky to get him in between those two. Oh, shit. Gone! Woo! No, that's okay. Koala conked. I got him. I hope everyone's having a good day. I'm going to have to wrap this up in uh, probably uh, the next eight minutes, guys, actually. It's been two and a half hours. Um, and I can hear the dog rattling around out there. I'll try and get past this stage, or at least... If I lose all my lives. <laughs> oh, hang on. Oh, my, my TV's back, sorry. My HDMI drops out a little bit sometimes on this um, screen. I'm not sure if it's the HDMI or the screen, but I, I will be investing in a um, gaming screen uh, sometime in the new year, um, hoping to. Concentration. I don't know if I can kill these dudes. Can't touch the red. Um, ones because obviously they're hot, and those ones have spikes. Oh, 
Oh! Tricky, tricky, tricky! Oh, I didn't think it was gonna classify that as a kill yet, then. Alright. We're getting there, guys. We're getting there. Such an interesting looking stage of music in this one. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I actually haven't eaten anything today as well. And I, I didn't get a chance to eat. Um, the last time I ate um, was probably about an hour, like 24 hours ago. So I'm really sorry, um, but I have to eat. Oh, I don't want to die. Oh, damn it. Oh. Yeah, I need to get some food. Food, food, food. Lives. That's right, you do actually use your lives. <gasps> Fuck it. Stuff it. Um, I'm going to run out of that life, uh, lives anyway, it looks like anyway. So at least when we start at Freshers, part three of this playthrough, um, it'll be much better. But I, I'm, maybe Josh, um, I'll be back on... Later this afternoon. I just need to, um... Oi! And that's the game. Oh, no. I did get another life. Oh, no. Here we go. I've got five. Um, yeah, I, uh, have... Some videos to film today. I'd love to get a head start on them. Same mistakes. But yeah, I can always try and jump back on this afternoon and do the part three of this um, playthrough on the PlayStation 4. Oh shit. Expect that. Oh, oh, I didn't really think of that. I don't know how I got out of that alive. down. Oh. Must be. Oh shit. Bump a bump a bump a Oh, 
shit. I got out of that so lucky the first time. Try not to rush it. And that's the game. Um, but thank you to everybody that has uh, joined me today for the stream, chatted about Christmas and all other things gaming. Uh, wish you all a very Merry Christmas if you can't jump onto one of my streams, um, obviously over this weekend um, and Christmas break. Uh, Joshy Boy, if I can jump back on later, I shall. Um, I just need to go and uh, have something to eat and uh, start filming some great content. I have three awesome videos that will be coming um, next week. And I'd actually like to try and get one um, uploaded this afternoon, uh, which will be an unboxing for a brand new item um, that I'll be using for all of my streams. So uh, I'll talk to you guys a little bit later and uh, take care.